If we're playing today, I think Jake would be our starter. And, uh, you know, we'll, uh, we'll just kind of go from there. But, uh, you know, I'm happy with both of them. I think we'll see how this week goes in practice. Uh, like I said the other day, really not trying to be coy. And uh, you know, I don't think it's going to affect Pitt at all in preparation because we're pretty much the team, same team you know, running the same plays offensively. But uh, we'll, we'll just see how the week materializes and uh, hope that both guys continue to prepare like they have been and, uh, and just see how things pan out. Would you consider using the rotation? Uh, you know, I'd consider anything. I'm not sure I'd want to do that, but uh, you know, we'll just see how it goes. This is uh, it's kind of been a unique experience so far. Uh, you know, I've known Dave for a long time. Uh, you know, we both were grad assistants at Pitt. The big difference is he played there. Uh, you know, and Pitt didn't want me there trying to win. So, uh, but he played there, coached there, left. Uh, four or five years, I guess, uh, not, not even that. He left when Jimmy Johnson went to Okie State, uh, late 70s. And, and then, you know, he'd come back and visit the year I was there, so I get to know him then, and, you know, we've crossed paths. Uh, ironically, when we were in uh, Cleveland, we used to go to Platteville and train against the Bears. Good, good people. Dave's an excellent coach. He's done a great job there, and uh, he's back home. I think, you know, some people you know, have the wrong idea about it, and they think it's, you know, it's a battle between us two, you know, who, you know, kind of like fighting on friends, but that's not really what it's like. You know, we both, you know, both team players, both want, you know, both want Iowa to win, and you know, whatever, you know, whatever it takes to get that done is, you know, what we want. And you know, whoever's out there, we're going to encourage each other because that's the only. I mean, you can't have negative energy in the locker room or on the field. You know, that's just going to that's going to feed, and it's going to, you know, go with the rest of the players, and that's just going to hurt us. And uh, the best thing we can both do is stay positive, you know, and help each other out. We, have, we don't feel like we've proven a whole lot yet either. Um, we can't, we can't, you know, go into this week thinking that, you know, we've got something really going. We've still got to work hard and still got to improve. And like you say, you know, our first two opponents weren't the toughest. And, you know, last week we didn't throw the ball extremely well. Granted, maybe the conditions had a lot to do with that. But the biggest thing for us is uh, we want to, you know, go into this week, hopefully get a win out of it and, you know, gain some momentum going into the week and schedule. I think they kind of, uh, they're the first guys that kind of set the tempo for the whole game. It's kind of up front. We uh, kind of they set they set the tempo for how we're going to play as a defense, and they kind of come out and, and they hit guys in the mouth for the most part. And I think that they kind of pride themselves in doing so. First couple of weeks, I mean, against Florida International or against Maine, especially yeah. those guys had more yards on the ground than uh, we were comfortable with, I guess. And that was we kind of looked at the films. We were pretty critical on ourselves as a defense, and those guys in the front the front four, especially. And uh, we kind of uh, you know got some stuff cleaned up, and it's something that those guys pride themselves on is these last couple of weeks not many rushing yards. So it's going to be huge for us. It'll be a huge test for us seen a great back and a, good, a really good offensive line this week.